Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Stardew Valley. All right, when we left off, we had just gotten started in our little farm here, got the stuff planted, and now we're essentially getting into the farm life. I just got back from a fishing trip. You should come on down to the beach for some time. I got something for you. Willie. All righty. I guess we're going to meet a guy named Willie. But I feel like I should be clearing out more of my farm, especially this area. Because apparently there's buildings over here. But, uh, we'll get to that. We'll get to that. Well, right now... Oops, that was not what I meant to do. I was trying to figure out the mission button. There we go, to the beach! Someone named Willie invited you to visit the beach south of town. He says he has something to give you. Alright, visit it before 5 p.m. Well, I mean, I might as well get it done early. I guess I can do the rest of the shit later. Ah. We eventually get a horse, right? Just to mosey on around town because fuck. This run is not a run. It's like a slow walk. Like, times three. That doesn't feel like a run to me. Oh, hey! It's an old guy smoking a pipe from the look of it. I assume you must be Willie. Oh, hey there, son. Hey, I was right. It was a pipe. Fuck yeah. Jesus, that hat is fucking dingy as hell. Actually, most of you is fucking dingy. What's wrong with you? I heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. Well, now I get to see you in all your dingy glory. I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. I should probably give him an accent, shouldn't we? Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. I don't know why I went pirate, but fuck it. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. I'm sorry, what? I'm assuming you mean fishing rod. Okay, cool. That is exactly what I meant. Okay. Here, I want to ha I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Well, I mean, maybe. Depends on uh, how essential it is. You received a bamboo pole. That's a very old, <laughs> very old fishing rod. If that's the case. Like, it was something you just made up yourself before you went out fishing on a boat. There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Oh, yeah. My shop's out. <laughs> my shop's back open now, so come on by if you need supplies. Also, buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what my old pappy used to say, anyway. Um... I'm not sure if I agree with that statement. I'm not sure if that's uh that's a thing you should be saying when it comes to fish. I'm pretty sure there's health standards involved that uh <laughs> you shouldn't be smelling that much. Also, you probably smell heavily of tobacco, and that's no fun for me. Now you're fishing. And can I go into the fish shack? No. Nope. Let's open at nine. Okay. Well, I'll go later then. Ooh, what's this? Cockle? Oh, what the fuck is this? A common saltwater clam. Okay, that's what it is. <clears throat> hmm. When <laughs> with three hundred pieces of wood, this could be fixed. What is? It? Are we determining this with our engineering skill? That it has to be 300 pieces? From the look of it, it could be like a million pieces. You don't know. Depends on how small the pieces of wood are. Do you know well, how small they could end up being? I guess he does. Okay. Ooh. Now, this is a thing I know about. Um, this. Uh, hey! New journal entry. You found an artifact. The curator of the local museum might want to know about this. Hey! One of the first things I run into after I head out on my own onto the beach. This beach is messy as fuck. 
Like, Jesus. There's so many, like, little bits of wood scattered around everywhere. And all of it looks the same after you hit a certain threshold. <laughs> okay. I'm making jokes. Because it's fun. Alright, uh, I guess I can sell one thing. Do I get anything for... Well, I assume I get something for, uh, giving the museum an artifact that I just found on the beach. Because clearly it's something important. Is this the... Archaeology office. So the museum, essentially. Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. I'm, I'm getting that feeling off the hat, okay? <laughs> I'm getting that fe feeling off the hat. Not a single piece in the entire collection. Well, I mean, I'm about to add one. Ugh! What's this? You found some. Let me see. Remarkable. It's very old. Well, I'd hope so, considering I just found it off the beach. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it is yours. I'm willing to give it to you. Hmm. I've got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We could make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows? If you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. Sounds good to me. Sure, why not? Think about it, will you? If you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. Absolutely. You gonna catch me on my way out or something? Nope, nope. Just showing that I'm going out the door and then coming right back in. Okay. Cool beans. Donate to the museum. Gunther can tell you more about this if you donate it to the museum. Um, is there a specific spot I'm supposed to put it? Or does it really fucking matter? Nope, I'm just gonna throw it wherever I fucking feel like it. Sounds good to me. Journal updated. Well, hey, he gave me money. Fuck yeah. He says he'll compensate you by way of occasional rare goods. And hopefully money? More money? Doesn't seem like you have anything to donate to the museum. Better get out there and do some treasure hunting, huh? Well, I mean, I guess I have to. There's a book missing here. What the... Then... Me. Do I need to get a... I guess I kind of want to know what the trilobite is. Trilobite, a long extinct relative of the crab. Alright. Now I know. Oh, hi there. I'm tutoring Vincent and Jazz today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. That's pretty right, Penny. Good on you. Good on you. But I don't see the kids with you. Oh, there's one of them. Mom won't let me have any more gummies today. How dare she? How dare she not let you have any gummies? Poor boy. What saloon? Hells yeah. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking, of course. Alright, what the... Ah, oh, my phone was uh, giving me a notification about my paycheck. <laughs> Alright. Like, hey, you know you got money? Just, yeah, I guess I do now. <laughs> Alrighty. Now that I'm back here, I guess I can sell that one thing. Uh, cockle, whatever the fuck it is. Uh... Do I really need fibers? Do I need fibers for anything? I need to double check. Um, gravel path, huh? Place on the ground to create paths or to spruce up your floors. With gravel? Why? Um, yeah, it doesn't look like I need fiber for anything. All right, I'll just sell it, I guess. I guess if that's an option, might as well. Whoopsie doopsie. <laughs> that was an oopsie doopsie on my part. Because I know this I can put away. Uh, mixed seeds. I could probably use that for stuff. 
what? I don't know, but, I mean, it's a mystery. No, I'll discover later. Alright. I'm in the wrong stupid fucking thing. I just want to carve my way through this fucking brush here. See what eventually shows up down here. Fucking hell, look at all these rocks. Fuck. Go through the grass only to run into rocks. Okay. Alright. Oh! A geo. A stone. <laughs> I saw a geode and then it says, you got a stone! You know, a different stone than the rest of the stones you've been collecting all fucking day. Oh, more coal! Nice. What, even more coal! Fuck yeah. I'll take it. Alright. I, I, eh? This little bit of grass here is in my way? Fuck you. How about that? Yeah, fuck. Oh, it's a nice little pond over here. Can I fish here? Oh, so that's how you fish. I fucked up. I fucked up hard. There we go. Hey! Hey! Oh, okay. That's how you do it. Oh, boy. Oh, geez. Oops. Hey, I did it! Hey, I got a sunfish! Woo! First fish ever! Haha! <laughs> Fuck yeah. Alright. Well, at least I know what I'm doing with fishing now. Alright. Come on. Cut these down a little more. There we go. Perfect. Alrighty. Now to... Throw that... Sunfish. What was it? Is that what it was? Sunfish? Uh... Yes, it was a sunfish. Hmm. Gives energy and health, huh? Blacksmith can break this open for you. Okay, well. Might need to test that. In a moment, though, because I want to dump some of this crap away. Uh, I should probably have a separate chest for tools, shouldn't I? Yeah, I'm thinking that's the case. It's gonna be a good idea. Um. I have not enough wood to make another treasure chest. Well work on that. And eventually, there we go. Ha <laughs> ha. Stump too, why not? Fuck off. Bullshit. Alright. Get rid of you. Cause fuck you. Cause fuck you. Alright. Knock this down. Perfect. All right. Not even close to the amount I need for the chest. But, getting there. And that's the important part. So, clearly, cutting down trees is the most uh, efficient way of getting wood. Which is obvious in retrospect. All righty. Time to get down this. There we go. Perfect. Is that all of it? Yeah, it looks like it's all of it. Okay. Uh, get rid of these. Cool beans. Uh, should organize my tools at some point. Just so I can easily switch to some of the more essential stuff. But uh, I'm too lazy right now. I'll do it off camera. How's that sound? Sounds good to me. Alright, um... So, I know... This building has been uncovered. Is there anything else this way? Oh, there's a thing over here. Oh, there goes a frog. Goodbye, frog. Oh, probably... Yeah. Break the rocks instead. Although, trees kind of do need to come down. Oh, I'm sorry, butterflies. Didn't mean to take your home same time needs to go 
Okay, well, there's that. Dealt with. Perfect. Up. Uh, out of my way. There we go. What is this over here? Wait for my return on the dawn of your third year, Grandpa. I'm sorry, third... What? Is Grandpa Jeebus? <laughs> is that what that's trying to tell me? Grandpa Shrine. R.I.P. Alright. I guess, uh, Grandpa's Jeebus. That is, uh, that's an interesting development. <laughs> Alright, let's stop making stupid jokes and start cutting down more trees. Oh boy, I am, I am nearly exhausted. pay attention to that exhaustion bar. Oh boy, our problems start to arise. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, throw that in there. Do this and this. And now I can make that chest. Uh, ingredients, wood. Well, I mean, obviously. I mean, I guess there's a little metal involved too, clearly. I mean, look at that. There's got to be some metal involved. Unless it's just, like, cheapo junk metal. Mild steel or some shit. There we go. And because this is going to be tool chest, let's make it... Nah, let's make it white. Just to contrast. So I know the difference. Alright. And uh, I should probably reorganize this a little. Since we're farmer first, water can first, then... Axe. Wait, no. No. Then hoe. Then axe. Then pickaxe. Ha ha! Ha 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 ha! I did it. Alright. Let's throw this in there. Wait, wait, wait first. Reorganize. Is there an organize button? Oh, yes, there is an organize button. Awesome. There's nothing really to organize there. Okay. Uh, time to go the fuck to bed. Because I'm almost exhausted, but in the same hand. I think I still need to meet people. Yeah, I have like ten people still to meet. Shit. Alright, well, guess I'll work on that. Although I kind of did it in a fucking weird-ass sort of way. So I don't even know who I haven't met and who I have met yet. So... Well, I guess we can go door to door now. Well, hi there. The beach is a cool place to hang out and soak up some rays. Okay, Alex. I talk to you. Looks like another gloomy day. Oh yeah, I have talked to you too. Don't mind my husband, George. He isn't very friendly. Well, yeah, most old men aren't. It's not his fault. I guess it kind of is. I still don't know whose trailer this is, and I'm just waltzing into for no real reason. You're Penny, right? Could you let me... Could I talk to you, please? Okay. Er, hi. I'm Clint. Well, hi there, Clint. I guess I haven't run into him yet, so I guess that's another one under the belt, huh? Yeah! Okay, cool. Alright, so... It's locked. Damn it. locked. Damn it! It's 8 p.m. Now everyone's going to sleep? Fuck off. 8 p.m. Going to sleep. <laughs> Come on. Fucking. Uh, maybe? A little? So have I met Pam? Get... Hey, Gus, give me another round. Okay. Now that I think about it, I knew her name, so... I work part-time at Gus's Saloons. It pays the bill. Or well, pays the bills, rather. I can't fucking talk, clearly. That's what that is. Can I go in there? Yes, I can. Okay, is this a place I can go into? Hey! I have no idea who... You know, would go in there. But hey. Oh, that's his room. Okay. That's fair. He has a couch and TV in his room? Fucking nice. 
has a maid. I only have a TV in my room. Alright. Nothing real good going on over here. There's a couple arcade games, but that's about it. There we are. Well, I've met who I'm going to be able to meet. Unless someone's doing a midnight stroll. Which, I mean, I guess is always possible. Might as well do one myself. Why not? Fuck it. Just a little stroll up through here. I've already seen this thing. Oh, I could... I could interact with some of the stuff up here, couldn't I? Alright. Ah, pfft. Everyone else is going to bed. Stupid. What? It's just some random camper? What? A stranger. Hello. Linus. Hi there. Don't mind me. I just live out here alone. You live like this? I mean, okay. I mean, your choice, but... Linus, buddy. Like, I, I could... I could rent you a... Well, maybe not rent, but... Uh, give you a house on my farm, man. I could make it. I mean, if you prefer this life, sure, but... I don't know, a lot of people who would... Pre prefer that life, you know? I mean, hey, it's an option at least. And I mean, if he's willing to do it, sure. It's getting late. Yeah, it is. Am I going to be able to make it? Am I going to be able to make it home before uh, the inevitable pass out like most of these games have? I know that the Harvest Moon series does. You just pass out and you go to your bedroom. Well, looks like I'm going to make it. Yep. Here we are. Did I ever water my plants? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, fuck me. Oh, I was too busy focused on everything else. Axe proficiency. Trees sometimes drop seeds. New crafting recipes. And I can make a field snack. Cool. All right. 80 bucks from that. 80 bucks. I mean, hey. Something, I guess. Oh, boy. Well... Let's see. What the fuck was that noise? Alrighty, this change might seem a little sudden, but we're going to have to end the other episode where it was, because, well, my recording software started shitting the bed at around day three. So, uh, we completed day two, we got a couple things done with it, and uh, day three, we'll uh, do next episode, because uh, currently, that's how my computer wants to do it. So, anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. Share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games and trying to get things done and forgot to actually water the plants in the last episode because I'm fucking stupid, but we'll, uh, have rain next episode, so there's that for you.